Hey guys, today we wanted to show you how to use the new 2017 Up A Baby Vista to see if it's the right stroller for you. It is a little bit different from older models, but the functions are basically the same. But if you have any questions, feel free to comment below or leave us an email at hello at babycubby.com. When folded, the Vista can stand all by itself. Just extend the handlebar, lock the wheels, and pull up on the fold tabs on either side of the frame and move the frame downwards. The stroller will even lock automatically. To unfold the stroller, undo the gray lock on the side of the frame and bring the handlebar up. To recline the Vista seat, press this gray button and bring the seat back. You can also adjust the footrest by pressing the buttons on both sides and moving it up or down. The belly bar is able to swing out for easy access. Just push the silver button located beneath the belly bar to release the latch. Adjusting the shoulder straps is easy. Pull the shoulder pad down to expose the hook and tab. Pull the tab out and slide the hook into it. The canopy features a height adjustment for taller children. Just pull up on both sides of it at the same time to smoothly slide it up and down the frame. To buckle and unbuckle your child, just press the gray button on the clip to release straps and insert it back into the clip and tighten as needed. The Vista features a telescoping handlebar. Press the gray button and adjust to your desired height. The magnetic peekaboo window makes it easy to check on your little ones without disturbing them. The magnetic closure is quiet and secure. The seats on the Vista can turn to face out or toward you. Push the gray buttons on both sides of the seat and then slide them into the attachments in your preferred direction. As you can see, the Vista features all-wheel suspension on its frame, making it an incredibly smooth ride. You can even lock the front tires by pressing the gray button for when you hit rough terrain. Press it again to release the lock. To remove the front wheel, slide over the gray tab and pull down. To replace the wheel, push it back up into place. The Vista's basket was made for easy access. To access things in the back, it easily moves down. It also features small pockets for storing snacks and water bottles. The piggyback board is a great accessory for your toddlers to ride along as well. Just snap it onto the back, making sure to align the screw and hole on the inside. When not in use, the piggyback will lock up into place. To release, push the button on the bottom and pull it down. The one-touch foot brake keeps the Vista sandal friendly. Just tap it with your foot to lock and unlock the brake. The bassinet attachment is incredibly easy to use. It attaches to the stroller in the same spot as the toddler seat. You know it is incorrectly when the indicator turns green. The bassinet features an adjustable canopy when you press the gray buttons. And the extra visor we love on all Uppa Baby strollers. It also has a zip on and off cover to protect your little one from everything. To remove the bassinet, press and slide the gray button on top of the canopy and lift. The Uppa Baby Mesa car seat fits directly into the Vista stroller in the same inserts as the toddler seat. To remove it from the stroller, press the button on top of the carry handle and pull up. You can also turn the seat to face forward if your baby prefers to look out. One of the best parts of the Vista is the rumble seat. First, you will need to add the rumble seat adapters to the stroller. Unsnap the basket, match up the color indicators, and then snap the adapter around the frame. Then attach the clip. You can then reattach the basket and repeat on the other side. Now you can attach the rumble seat to the adapters. A little known fact is that you can still fold the Vista with the rumble seat and piggyback board attached. Both seats need to be forward facing. You must adjust the toddler seat's footrest back and the piggyback must be in the up locked position. Then fold and unfold as usual. Each seat features an extendable canopy and the belly bar. 
as well as the ability to face you, the parent. You can use the car seat adapter or bassinet in the addition to the rumble seat with the help of upper adapters. Just match the color indicator to the correct side of the frame and slide it into the same attachments used for the toddler seat. You can now attach the bassinet or the car seat as usual. The upper adapters allow more distance in height and depth between the rumble seat and the other accessories. The Mesa releases from the button on the top of the handlebar. Depending on your car seat, you may have to release it from the back or the sides of the car seat. For configurations not using the rumble seat, you will need to attach the lower adapters. Again, unsnap the basket, match the colored indicator to the correct side, and then snap the adapter onto the frame. You can now attach the bassinet and car seats to the front position of the stroller for even more versatility. Here are a few configuration options. To see more, check out our configuration video. I hope this how-to video was helpful in helping you learn how to use your 2017 Up A Baby Vista. Like I said, it will be a little bit different for older models. If you still have questions on which adapters you need for which configurations, feel free to leave a comment below or send us an email at hello at babycubby.com. If you liked this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel where we do more reviews, how-tos, and even fun things like gender reveals. If you're looking to purchase the Up A Baby Vista, it retails for $8.79 or $8.99, depending on which version you get. You can buy that at babycubby.com, where anything over $49 ships for free. We have everything from clothing to gear and all the fun things in between.